Okay, Hades Wing here. So uh, we're gonna try uh, these uh, adjustable, uh, the self ratcheting uh, straps um, with the uh, with a uh, heavier motorcycle, 475 pound uh, electric motorcycle, and uh, and we're gonna use. But but this time I have the aid of a self locking uh, chalk right here. So hopefully the chalk works. I I haven't used it yet. So um, all right, here we go. So the idea is, uh, I'm gonna, we're gonna roll the the bike up the ramp onto the trailer and then lock it into the the uh, the chalk, and then we're just gonna use the ratcheting straps to tie it down. Um, and I hopefully hopefully this will be a lot easier than uh, than uh, than just using the traditional chalk because um, I, I it, it'd be a lot easier with a heavier bike, you know. All right, here it goes. There it is. So the bike is secure. Uh, yeah. So the chalk, uh, uh, using a self-locking chalk is a lot easier than not having it. Um, so one of the one of the things I'm worried about is this this thing flopping all over the place and hitting hitting my motorcycle, which I don't think I don't think it'll do. Um, oh, well, I did it backwards. Oh, okay, okay. Okay, so I did one strap. I did one strap. Uh, here, let's let's get, let's get a little closer. So I did one strap the opposite direction, um, and I think I I prefer to ratchet it this way from top to bottom. But I guess you could do it the other way. I I pinched my finger on this, so so yeah. Um, but there's less stuff to hit here. Even if that flopped around all over the place, it uh, it won't damage anything. This won't hit anything either. I, I kind of rotated it all the way, and it doesn't do anything. So, hopefully, these straps are pretty strong. <laughs> um, it's probably co it looks like it's coiled in there a couple times, maybe like four or five. Maybe you might want to make it a little looser so it, it wraps around this a little more, because um, it looks like you can coil it around there a little bit more. Okay. So uh, okay. So what I'm gonna try is uh, I'm gonna try to flip this one over. How about that? Uh, I'll loosen both of them and then we'll, we'll, we'll do it from the other direction. Okay, wish me luck. I'm going to uh, let the lid loose. Oh, the bike still does move a little bit. <laughs> I'm just going to flip 
this one over. has uh, tie down loops already in it, so I might move this other side. <laughs> okay. Alright, so there it is. I did it the other direction. I feel I, I think it's I think for these straps it's probably best to uh to mount it like that with the with the uh the handles going from bottom to top on a mo on a motorcycle. So yeah, there it is. Alright, so I'm gonna try to let it loose one more time and then I'm gonna uh roll the bike off the trailer and wish me luck. <laughs> but uh it was that was fairly easy um so uh, um i i would probably ride drive like this but i i would add a second um two more ties one back here and one back over there but uh yeah so far uh, i like it the strap is uh, it's really nice uh, so we'll just have to really try them out and they match the color of my bike they're red <laughs> so okay i'm gonna try to download my bike from the trailer now Well, there you go man um so uh getting it out of the chalk was kind of hard um i had to really pull to get it out of there. i had to actually get on the bike and pull it out but but it was in there 
it wasn't going anywhere. <laughs> okay, so, uh, so yeah, that's like kind of my new trailer setup, and uh, and then that's the first time we use the self ratcheting, um, self uh, self adjusting straps, um, the quick loader straps, with a heavy bike, <laughs> a 475 pound bike. So, and uh, it looked like it worked pretty good. All right, so, so yeah. Oh hey, there it is, man. My my motorcycle survived the whole way with these uh, these uh, self-adjusting ratcheting straps. So uh, I'm pretty pretty stoked. I like them. Um, they're the same color as my bike too, so that's the cool thing. I, I install them upside down, then look more like I normally don't do. Um, so it keeps this away from here, so this doesn't hit. It still does flop around a whole lot, but I didn't have any problems with it towing bike here, so. So yeah, there we go. I like them. Um, the only only thing that I don't like is they're expensive. So um, to get like to get like four of those would be like eighty dollars. Yeah, it would be eighty dollars to get all four. So um, I think I'm probably I may buy another pair. But uh, yeah, I may buy another pair. I wish they had them in different colors too. I want a black one for for that bike. Um, yeah, so I may buy another pair. Um, because it, it keeps it everything nice and tidy. I don't have to worry about this stuff, this spaghetti stuff all over the place. So yeah, uh, but it worked pretty good with this Harbor Freight chuck. Um, I didn't have any problems, so all right.